Hello, welcome to Sampling. This is David from Soul Sound Audio. We're going to sample in Logic Pro today. We're going to use the EXS24 instrument. So let's get going. All right, let's create an audio track. Um, let's bring in, bring in our first sample. There it is. Um, we can hit W to bring up the wave editor. Check out where the transients are at. Looks pretty okay to me. All right, and we're going to hit Control E to bring up Convert to New Sampler Track. Okay, ready? Make sure it's selected. Control E. We're going to go from transient markers, starting at C1. Call it what you want. One shot zones means when you trigger it, it'll play all the way through instead of being able to trigger release and play just parts of the sample. So we're going to leave it right there. All right, here we are. So it gives us uh, a sample for each transient. Here it's on the 16th note. All right, we can play it. We can slow it down, speed up. That's kind of what, what's happening when you use slicing to speed stuff up and slow stuff down. Um, so we've got our All right, so we can create a little beat here. In fact, let's let's change the tempo. Let's change the tempo so we're creating something different than what the original thing was. Now, also, if you want to do something different, you can create, like, let's take one of these and pitch it down, put it in reverse, all right, so, we're going to create another track with the same instrument. There we go. All right, and then we can just grab another sample. Uh, let's check out where these transients are at because it's not a very transient thing. So it looks like, in fact, let's just meet that region. All right, that's way too many. We just want each chord so sometimes what you gotta do well we can also do it like this so forget the transients let's go and just chop it chop it where the chords are at then what we're gonna do is control E go by regions alright so I think the tempo shift is messing with that a little bit. That's probably what's happening. All right, here we go. All right. Here we go. So So there you go. That's uh, sampling. And of course, we can go in and if we want to change some of these, we could, for example, copy this one. 
option or um, command C command V all right and then we can we can create our own thing here So now, let's go ahead and create a new track with the same instrument, and then we can just add this little walk-up thing. cool so that's it thanks for tuning in i uh, hope you learned something have some fun with this uh, the possibilities are endless take care we'll see you next time don't forget to subscribe and check out our other videos bye, -bye.